Brian here with Help Sell My RV.com out of Louisville, Kentucky, where all RVs and trucks are for sale by owner. I'm going to do a walk around on this beautiful, fully loaded 2012 Dodge Ram 3500 Laramie Longhorn diesel dually truck. Overall, truck is pretty much in excellent condition. If a dealer was going to take it in on trade, I think they would agree with me. Uh, this is this is fully loaded. Uh, it does have a lot of features. As you can see, the front does have the upgraded uh, bumper and brush guard. It is made by Warren. This is about a $5,000 setup here. Uh, it does have the uh, 12,000 pound Warren winch on the front. And that, uh, all that was definitely a five, about a five thousand uh, dollar price tag on the front end. It is equipped. The truck is equipped with the six point seven liter, three hundred and fifty horsepower inline six uh, turbo diesel engine. Is a crew cab, four by four. Does have the aluminum Alcoa polished wheels. These are seventeen inch wheels. All the tires were pretty much replaced here to within the past couple of years. Uh, this tire, show you the manufacturing date, right here, 25th week of 2015. And the rear duallys on this side are the same date, 2015s. And all tires are in excellent condition. It does have running boards, chromed out running boards. You do have the chromed out side mirrors, chromed out uh, handles door handles there we go pop up the, the tow mirrors here you can pop them up if you're towing a fifth wheel uh, toy hauler or horse trailer and you can just pop them right back down uh, you do have the beautiful marker lights there beautiful ram badge laramie badge there in the paint everything is in excellent condition it does have tinted windows this is a long bed, it's an eight foot bed, uh, and it's excellent condition, I'll show you that. Uh, your duallys, as I said, they're 2015, the tires, they are all Michelins. Uh, these were made, uh, the I forgot the week, but they're definitely 15s, and they're in excellent condition. There's your aluminum polished Alcoa wheels. Nice uh, Longhorn badge on the center hub there. Does have the upgraded uh, suspension in the rear. Does have airbags. Show you the airbag there. Back up, kind of give you an idea of the side here. Beautiful truck, as I said, it's fully loaded. Pretty much has every option that uh, they offered in 2012. Again, it's four by four. You have the integrated backup camera there. Yeah, nice, beautiful Ram badge. Eight foot bed, it is lined. I'm not sure if it's factory or if it's a line ax aftermarket, uh, but it's definitely, uh, they definitely did a great job on the liner, spray on liner, and uh, truck bed is in excellent condition. You do have a seven way pigtail up front there. The owners uh, did have a slide in camper, a Lance 1172 fully loaded slide in camper in this. That's why they have a little seven way pigtail up front there. And you do have a seven-way pigtail hook up here. And of course, you do have a hitch receiver on the back. I'm going to show you the undercarriage here. That rear end, I believe, is a 410 rear end that they put on the uh, 3500s duallys. You do, have, of course, have the uh, parking sensors, the monitors. It goes beep, beep, beep. Show you all the rim badges there. Beautiful truck. Color is black on the truck. Uh, the date on the rears, uh, something here. Here we go. On the driver's side, uh, the date on the tires are the 42nd week of 2016, and of course they're excellent condition. The owners just replaced the, uh, uh, these tires, and I believe the one up front on the driver's side. Again, it's a crew cab. I don't know if I pointed that out. Go ahead and show you the date on this. Yep, 42nd week, 2016. Go ahead and show you the inside here. Nice, beautiful, chromed out running boards. 
this is fully equipped. Uh, it does have the all leather with the beautiful stitching. And, uh, the leather inside is going to be a brown. Uh, power everything, power locks, power windows, uh, power heated mirrors. does have full power seats. They're all memory. Uh, your seats, uh, beautiful leather and stitching. Kind of zoom in on that. Nice longhorn badge on the seats. All the seats are in excellent condition. Uh, and I believe they're heated. Here we go. Nice uh, longhorn badge there. This is all leather. Beautiful stitching. Huge storage space. You do have a uh, charging port here. Nice 12 volt charging port. And more storage here. I'm not sure if they're calling this uh, somewhat of a cooler or not. You do have another charge port here. I believe the center console was an option. Uh, this is equipped. Yep. With the uh, with uh, you have the heated seats and then you can cool them off. Uh, you do have a heated steering wheel and of course heated seats on the other side for the uh, pilot and co-pilot. As I said, it's four wheel drive. Here's your four wheel drive switch over. I'm gonna hop up in here. Turn on beautiful smart wheel, nice RAM badge there. Uh, this is uh, it does have the uh, smart wheel with the hookups uh, for voice command. It is Bluetooth ready. Your stereo, uh, of course, your phone call, everything like that. Uh, this is your automatic uh, uh, cruise control. All that. And it's easy to figure out. I'm going to zoom in here, show you the mileage currently on this truck, 61,643 miles. And they are not work miles. Uh, this is not a work truck. It never was used as a work truck. You can definitely tell when you look at it. Um, it was just used basically for camping. Uh, this steering wheel is full power. You can, or I'm sorry, adjustable, and you do have power adjustable uh, pedals down at the bottom here. You do have an awesome uh, integrated brake control system on this thing. Six speed uh, automatic transmission and you can actually uh, manually shift down and shift up. It does have an Alpine stereo system. Uh, it's all touch screen. Uh, I believe they're calling this, this might be a eight inch. I think they're calling this probably an eight inch. I know the 2014s are eight and a half inch touch screens, but this looks like probably an eight inch uh, touch screen. Uh, it's full interactive, smart devices, whatever you want to do. Uh, okay, uh, this is your exhaust brake. You can set an exhaust brake. This is your tow haul. Pretty much adjust your transmission if you're pulling something. Uh, and then uh, this is your park assist. So when you're backing up, uh, and you're hooking up to a trailer, you don't want that park assist activated. You don't want to be beeping and beeping and beeping, so you can turn it off right there, and it will stop the beeping because it will drive you nuts. All right, and you do have uh, two glove compartments, one here, one there. Nice place to put your cell phone. And up here, you do have uh, a garage door opener uh, option if you want to sync it to your garage door. Oh, and you do have a sunroof, power sunroof, can't forget that, okay, let's turn this off. Oh, and you do, you can control uh, as far as uh, looking to see how you are on your truck, you can uh, toggle little buttons here and uh, you can see where you are on oil pressure, uh, fuel economy, uh, even uh, tire pressure, uh, pretty much tells you where you are on the whole coach. Or the whole truck, sorry. All right, 
in the back here, I do want to point out before I forget, uh, there are uh, WeatherTech liners uh, up in the front, co-pilot and pilot seat, and in the back here. It's about a $500 package of uh, uh, WeatherTech liners. Nice storage. You have the little coolers here up underneath. Uh, they're calling those coolers. Looks like they're opting for, uh, I guess, uh, electronics. But uh, you can put some ice in there, put some drinks, beers, whatever, odds and ends. And uh, all this flips up fairly easy if you want to store something pretty big. It does have a, a DVD player that's integrated up in the top here. And you do have uh, charging ports here. Oh, I do want to point out these saddlebags. Beautiful saddlebags in the back. Put this down. Kind of show off the uh, seats. As I said, th th this uh, truck is beautiful. And in pretty much excellent condition. You do have a, kind of a wood grain look here on all the doors. Nice chrome. Of course, power windows. Let's go around to the other side. I do want to point out uh, the fuel cell on this. Uh, they're calling it, I believe, a 34 gallon uh, diesel fuel cell on this. Kind of show all around. Give you a pretty good idea on the condition. Again, coolers on each side. And this is a non smoker. wood grain I was talking about. Weather tech liners in the co-pilot seat area. Power seats. Looks like the sun's getting me. Alright, on the lighting. Uh, if you want to come and see the truck, just call the number on the ad. You deal directly with the owner. Uh, if you like this video, I'd appreciate it if you give it a thumbs up on YouTube. And if you want to keep track of what's coming available for sale by owner in the Louisville area, as far as RVs and trucks, you can follow HelpSellMyRV.com on Facebook, Twitter, Pinterest, and YouTube. Thank you for watching, and see you next time.